Bangalore, a bustling metropolis and a hub for real estate investment, operates on a unique property registration system known as Kata. For any prospective property buyer, grasping the intricacies of the Kata system is paramount. A Kata, meaning account in Canada, serves as a legal document issued by the Bruhat Bengaluru Mahanagara Palike, BBMP, or the local municipal body. It essentially acts as your property's identity, holding crucial information about the property and its ownership. Think of the Kata as your property's passport in Bangalore's real estate landscape. It records vital details, including the property's size, location, and ownership. More importantly, the Kata plays a pivotal role in property tax assessment and collection. It enables the authorities to determine the property tax you owe, ensuring a smooth and transparent taxation process. However, the Kata system in Bangalore is not as straightforward as it may seem. It encompasses different types of Kata classifications, each with its own set of implications for property owners. These classifications, namely A Kata, B Kata, and Panchayat A Kata, often lead to confusion among buyers. Understanding the distinctions between these classifications is crucial to making informed decisions and avoiding potential legal complications down the road. In the upcoming sections, we will delve deeper into each Kata type, shedding light on their significance and implications for property buyers in Bangalore. Stay tuned to navigate the complexities of the Kata system with confidence. Navigating the world of real estate in Bangalore requires a clear understanding of the different Kata classifications. The most important distinction lies between A Kata and B Kata properties. An A Kata is the most desirable classification indicating that the property is fully legal and compliant with all building bylaws. It signifies that the property taxes are paid up to date and the owner faces no legal hurdles in conducting transactions. A B Kata, on the other hand, denotes a property that may have some deviations from the approved building plans or pending property tax payments. While B Kata properties are not entirely illegal, they do come with certain limitations. Obtaining loans for B Kata properties can be challenging and their resale value may be affected. Adding another layer to the Kata system is the Panchayat E Kata. This classification applies to properties that were initially under the jurisdiction of village panchayats and subsequently came under the purview of the BBMP. E-Kata properties often lack proper documentation and may face complications during the regularization process. To illustrate the differences, consider a scenario where you are looking to purchase a property. An E-Kata property would be like buying a car with all the necessary paperwork and a clean history. You can be assured of its legality and face no obstacles in its use or sale. A B Kata property, however, is akin to buying a car with some minor documentation issues. While it may function well, selling it later could pose challenges. Understanding these classifications is not just about legal compliance. It directly impacts your financial investment. An A Kata property ensures a secure and hassle-free ownership experience, while B Kata and E Kata properties may bring uncertainties and potential legal battles. In the following sections, we will delve into the importance of Akata and guide you through the process of Kata verification. In Bangalore's real estate market, understanding the Kata system is crucial. An Akata is more than just a document. It signifies a property's legal standing. It ensures the property meets all legal requirements and is free from disputes. This legal clarity provides peace of mind and financial flexibility. Banks readily approve loans for Akata properties, recognizing their lower risk. This ease of access to finance is invaluable for buying or investing. An Akata also enhances the resale value of your property. Buyers prefer properties with a clean legal record, boosting marketability. In contrast, Bkata or Ekata properties face financial and legal hurdles. These complications can lead to financial losses and stress. Opting for an Akata property safeguards your investment and enhances value. It's a crucial factor in Bangalore's real estate landscape. Next, we'll explore the Kata verification process to help you make informed decisions. Embarking on a property purchase is a significant financial decision, and it's essential to approach it with caution and due diligence. In Bangalore's dynamic real estate market, Kata verification emerges as a critical step in ensuring a safe and secure transaction. It acts as a shield protecting you from potential pitfalls and fraudulent activities. 
Carta verification is the process of verifying the authenticity and legitimacy of a property's Carta document. It involves confirming the details mentioned in the Carta with the official records maintained by the BBMP or the concerned municipal authority. This seemingly simple step can make a world of difference, preventing you from falling prey to scams or purchasing a property with legal encumbrances. Imagine investing your hard-earned money in a property only to discover later that the Carta document is forged or that the property is embroiled in legal disputes. Such situations can lead to financial losses, lengthy legal battles, and immense stress. Carta verification acts as a safeguard against such nightmares, providing you with the peace of mind that your investment is secure. Before finalizing any property deal, it is crucial to conduct a thorough Carta verification. This involves obtaining a copy of the Carta extract from the BBMP office or verifying the details online through the BBMP's official website. Cross-checking the property details, ownership information, and tax payment status with the official records is essential to ensure their accuracy. Furthermore, seeking legal counsel from a qualified property lawyer is highly recommended during the verification process. A lawyer can help you navigate the complexities of property documents, identify potential red flags, and ensure that the property you're purchasing is free from any legal encumbrances. Their expertise can prove invaluable in securing a smooth and hassle-free property transaction. Carta verification is not merely a procedural formality, but an indispensable step in making a sound property investment in Bangalore. It empowers you with the knowledge and confidence to proceed with your purchase, knowing that you are making a secure and informed decision. By taking the time to verify the Carta, you are protecting your financial interests and ensuring a smooth and hassle-free ownership experience.